When I was a prosecutor, especially a federal prosecutor, and we were doing proactive investigations and we wanted to find the top person in an organization, the best way to do that is to track the money and try to investigate money laundering or structuring offenses because the money always, always, always leads you back to the main person. Uh, when I would have police officers and federal agents sitting in my office, we would sit there and they'd be really excited about some corruption case or drugs or, or, or these things that are being found and all the time I'm thinking of where is this money going and how can we track it and we utilized the money laundering statutes in the United States Code extensively and they were very helpful in making cases. Similarly as now that I'm a defense attorney and I'm working on these cases from the other side it's very clear that there's a lot of situations where there might be a money laundering investigation going on when that's simply not the case and based on my experience I'm able to use that and show the prosecutors, show the agents that they're on the wrong case.